Government shutdown could affect more than services and the employees who deliver them. What about the sixth graders? Yeah, what about them? Nine on your side's Tony Maronis explains how one local school's annual trip could get less than it bargained for if the government shuts down. Students practice playing after school. Oh, say can you see? Elizabeth Blair belts it out for her future and for her country. This makes me feel happy, I guess. I just really like it. You keep your beat. The national anthem is fitting for the sixth grader because tomorrow she will be traveling with 80 of her classmates to the nation's capital. Two years ago, her older sister Caroline made great memories on the annual event. It was like a really cool experience because we got to go through George Washington's house. Because she's told me all about it and it sounds like so much fun and I just couldn't wait to see it. She might not get to see much because of the possible government shutdown. It could be a strong lesson in politics instead. I think in some aspects it'll bring the reality of everyday Washington kind of to the forefront. This father, Patrick Henry, has the name of a forefather, but he's not wanting liberty or death, just education. Both the historical things about our government, how it was founded, you know, what it's founded on. One, two. Founded on hard work, like Elizabeth's determination to play the piano. Her mother says sixth graders are coming, shut down or not. Sometimes we have disappointments in life. And the home. A life that she's ready to experience. Tony Moronis, Nine on Your Side, Fort Mitchell. The travel agency for the group has made alt alternate plans for the kids if the government shuts down tomorrow. You know, you were just saying you remember your trip to yeah, when I was Washington. A kid. We all do. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. yeah, it's important stuff. Yeah, when you first walk into the Lincoln Memorial and look uh, at the enormity uh -huh. of it, at that moment in time, you get some sense of pride for your country. Uh -huh. You really uh -huh. do. Yeah. Well,